I mean, he died. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. Well, jeez. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. Home. In Sparta. Where were Sparta's allies? The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king Bleh. looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. It's the ultimate sacrifice. What happened to the traitor, Ephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well, but treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived. A coward. Good. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I'd convinced myself was a dream. Until now, a peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Andros? Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Oh my god! Your spear and that place are connected. I mean, we know who they are, right? But let's ask about the Isu. You mentioned the people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in They caves, weren't intelligent enough to not give humans free will. Suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. Yeah, I told you guys about that myth, didn't I? <laughs> Andros is a little island on the eastern side of the map. When I was leveling up, I went from Megaris to back to Kefalonia, back to Megaris, to Phokis, to all these places, and I was going to go to Andros next. I sailed to Andros. I have walked on Andros. Yeah, when I booted up the game today, I was in Andros. I was on the beach. And I ran around a little looking for a viewpoint so I could fast travel back, and I just didn't find one, and I was like, whatever, I'll just sail back, it doesn't matter. I've been to Andros. I didn't see anything strange. But, wow, I was really close. I was really close to discovering all that on my own. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. Okay. I'll meet you at my ship. I don't know, dude. Like... Bye, Leonidas. Um... I don't... He just literally showed up. Already knew about the cult. Already knew about the spear. Apparently also knew about me. To some extent. And it's just like, I'll do whatever I can to help you. What? Like, hey, look at all my little assassin friends. Where's Welcome Evie? Aboard there she is. Adrestia, Irodotos. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. <laughs> I have business to attend to in Athens. Irodotos is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Irodotos on your path. Just like they There's put you Evie. on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension. All we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. Herodotus and I share enemies too. Like El Pinor? He is... was... part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Why don't you be no, quiet, Barnabas? You didn't see what I saw. I need to find her. 
before they do. And I believe they will hurt others who oppose their views along the way. By Hermes, the Oracle lost to corruption, and now this cult? Do we know who leads them? I don't know for nope. sure. The ghost of Cosmos, but... He's not the leader. Shark! Zeus, your life is complicated. <laughs> That's putting it mildly. Worry, this cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies, and one of them fights like Athena and shit thunder like Zeus. We'll bring the wrath of the gods down upon them. Yeah, we will. Is he this positive? Yeah, he is. <laughs> Poseidon, carry us to Athens. First, we need to go to Andros. To Andros, then. We're going to have to do some upgrades to my ship. Oh yeah! <laughs> That's so great! Well, she's old, and perhaps not in the best condition. You couldn't have said this before we set sail? Where in Poseidon's name are we going to get the supplies? Take your pick. My father taught me that the sea takes, and we must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of pirate ships in these waters that we can board and take from. What are we waiting for? Let's hunt some pirates! Maybe I'll do that- hold on. I don't know if this is an Odyssey quest, it's probably not. Um, hold on. That's all that stuff. Um, hell yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a Barnet Best quest. Okay, well, we're not gonna do that right now. Um, I'll do that on my own time. I don't have a whole lot more time before I gotta restart, but I at least wanna go see this island. So, let me go back to the map. I know where Andros is. It's right, uh, it's down here. Oh, I should have gone around the other way. Maybe I will go around the other way. Me. I can't fast travel anymore because I want a ship. Today, Cassandra. The sea is calm and the winds are strong. It's good. It is, my friend. It sure is. You said that already. And I completed it! Okay, awesome! <laughs> that was easy! And actually, hold on. I, uh, can I upgrade my ship at all right now? Oh, I have a spot for another lieutenant! Well, I know who that's gonna be. That's gonna be Bayek! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's awesome! So much wood! Oh my god! That's, that's too much. I'm not upgrading that right now. Where's Bayek? Get that sail up! Where is my Bayek? There he is! Look at him! Oh yeah! I got Bayek and Eevee on my ship! How cool is that? But of course, now, my biggest question here, of all the characters- Oh shit, I sailed into something not great. Okay. Of all the characters they could have brought back, in this game to serve as lieutenants on your ship. Why is Edward or Shay not an option? Or heck, even Connor in his na in his naval outfit. Like, I I feel like those uh, were, would be great options. But Bayek is really cool too. And there's the sunken temple of Aphrodite right there, which would be awesome. But we're not doing that right now. We'll show them what we're made of. No, we won't. You won't do shit. Why is the music so intense? But anyway, like, the first trailer for Detroit I saw was the hostage, things could have been different scene for Connor. And when he's like, hi, Daniel, my name is Connor, I was like, oh, Connor, really? And of course, the first Connor I think of is Radun Hagedo from Assassin's Creed 3. Now it's completely backwards. I was like, it's really weird calling this character Connor because I'm holy whale. I was just so used to calling a different character Connor, you know? But now it's completely different. If I hear the name Connor, I don't think of Red and Hagedo, and I think of RK-800. <laughs> it's, it's weird how, it, how things have reversed in just a few short months. Oh, they sing in female voices, too, because it's an all-female crew. Besides Bayek, of course. I bet he's a little uncomfortable. But, oh, that's awesome! Question. Ask away. How did you find it? I didn't. My mother told me the Spartan army brought it back from the Battle of Thermopylae. Why bring it back to her? 
Their leaders was her father. Incredible. I think so he's his grandfather. Damn. Perhaps he's trying to guide you. Show you a power. There's more. It helps me in battle. What do you mean? I can't really describe it. It's like I know what my opponent's next move will be just before it happens. Fascinating. This is just extraordinary. Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice. Alright, bye, Kenevi. Docking! Ah, this looks familiar. Welcome to Andros, ladies and gentlemen. Pardon me. There's much to do, and many unknowns Many, many. Oh, I love their singing! Oh, it's so pretty! Okay. Oh, cool, I can get contracts here. I don't really want to do that right now, though. Oh, sorry, sorry, excuse me. Alright, bye, Kadeebi. Keep watch on the ship for me, and you, Barnabas. I will be back. Western part of the abandoned forest. A huge door protects the entrance. Western side of the abandoned forest, so it should be over here-ish. Okay, let's go. Excuse me, where the fuck is it on my map? Here it is. That's it. Okay. And those mythical creature locations, those seem like they'll be really exciting. So maybe I'll do those as like a bonus video series or something. Because I think that would be fun to do on camera. Freaking bears everywhere in Greece. Jeez. Oh, ankles. I was this close to it. How on earth did I miss this? <laughs> no way! Oh, dude, this looks just like the entrance to the observatory, almost. Is that... a door? I've never seen anything like it before. Right? Don't worry, that's perfectly normal. How do I get inside? The spear. I wonder if... More memories. Oh. I only have 15 minutes till my webcam stops, so... Oh. Who's there? Come out! That was the spear. Hesitation only hastens. The grave, I know, Mater. Your form is improving. Your resolve is strong. But you're not taking action. I was going to. I know. But it's the moments in between that decide everything. I mean... Your turn. You could have just let me kill it, you know? Leonida's spear. You're old enough now. My father's spear holds a certain burden, but... You're ready. Where did you go, Madre? I felt something. Oh? Huh? The spear. It has magic. It carries with it a long line of power. A bloodline of incredible heroes. The same blood within you and me and our family. All but, of us? But not Nicholas. Think of Leonidas. He had great courage. And he made a great sacrifice. You share his blood and the strength he possessed. We are able to feel certain things happening around us. That is our family's gift. But not everyone understands that. Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. <laughs> cool. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. I know. You're a warrior. If we keep moving forward, always moving forward, we're untouchable. Storm's coming in. Then maybe we should move forward now. <laughs> it's the theme song for the Untouchables movie. Kevin Costner, Sean Connery. Robert De Niro is in that movie too, isn't he? Great movie. Brutal. Great movie. Nash, I am just a poor beat cop. 
I can't do Sean Connery's voice very well. <laughs> Mother. I haven't forgotten you. Never. Never ever. Oh my word in heaven. But now the question where did Leonidas get the spear? Where did it it's obviously a lot older than him having it forged for himself. That thing's gotta be at least what, seventy thousand years old? Tens of thousands of years old. Where did he get it? By the gods. Who built on this? Oh, I love first civilization. Similar ancient forge. This must be where it was made. That's why it opens. Oh my god. I love scenes like this. Oh, this is when I love this game. How does a place like this exist? It's a lot to comprehend. I've seen so many of these ancient sites, How and could it's I even still... explain this to someone like Marcos? Don't. I can't interact with it. This is what the, 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 the stele in the tombs look like. They have this same, like, digital radiance around them, for lack of better word. Am I gonna repair the spear to its full? Something's glowing over there. Stuff glowing everywhere. Oh, oh wait, no, I see what you're talking about. Oh, this is so cool. This is when I love Assassin's Creed. I am. This is where it was forged. I can't read that. Forge activated. Synchronizing retransmission chronicity. Contact engaged. Oh my god. Wait, Alethea? What is happening? What are we loading into right now? I don't have time for this! I only have 10 minutes! Okay, hold on. While we're loading... One second. Alright, I just had to reset my webcam. But we've got time. Oh! Well, hello. Demos. The Forge. Well, hello I there. I knew I let VR. you stay in the Animus too long. Your vitals are crashing. You don't understand. This confirms it. Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology. She had the means to improve it. Imagine how powerful the staff could be. I admit. That could be an incredible find. But right now, I'm the doctor, and I take care of you. Now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra. You're right. If you insist, but only because I've got work to do on the outside. Please, just clear your head. The last thing we need is a cell leader suffering from the bleeding effect and spearing us because we're Hittites or Thracians. I won't. But Thracians throw great parties. Don't forget, uh. we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday, and he's keeping an eye out. Elena's on call doing historical research. And I'm here to talk if you're feeling any confusion from the Animus. Always the therapist. Okay. Mm I feel like I don't know who Kiroshi or Alana or any of these people are because I haven't played the DLCs for Origins yet. And I'm, I'm missing, a, I, I have a hole in the story that I'm missing. Oh, God. But yeah, like, she's right. There's no point in me killing myself in that machine. There's no point to that. So, what do you think of my but new But it's cool, animus? we control what Layla you says, too. our new Animus? That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahmin variant, with the I.O. capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA and CERN combined. Well, hot damn. Cool, yo. Again, how do- we're not working for Abstergo. We're with William and the Assassins, aren't we? Again, I haven't played the DLC, so I don't know what the holy hell happened, but we have Dr. Bibo working for us now, who is definitely an Abstergo employee. Weird. 
I mean, you know, I'll put it all together eventually at some point. <laughs> but for now, I'm missing a piece of the puzzle. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. The, the, the if what I saw in Egypt is true, this event? staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. That sounds the like something we shouldn't right do. Here, and it's not doing anything. The spears attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Theomos, I mean, Alexios. They were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the staff of Hermes then? No. But is if that the what it is? get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. Hmm. See, now that gets me thinking again. Because the thing that I discovered during Syndicate shenanigans, it was one of the last, if not the last, like, Templar audio files you could find from collecting all the Animus fragments, was it? And they said that they found a ten-year-old boy whose mother brought him into their clinic. And... Grammatica wanted to strip him for parts, like we did with Subject 17, which pissed me off. Uh, and they, like, named off his whole, like, lineage and which eras it went through, and it was pretty much almost all the historical eras that Desmond's lineage is in. And we don't know if it's Desmond's kid, but, like, I don't know. It was just, like, it seemed like that ten-year-old boy was gonna be so freaking important. And then there was no mention of him at all in Origins. And I don't know. They're, they're looking for someone who can wield the staff of Hermes. Hermes. And I don't know. It probably it probably doesn't connect that way, but, you know, I thought that <laughs> I thought that Demos wasn't my brother, even though I said it out loud, and whoop de doo he's my brother, so who knows? I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Absurgo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. Everything involving Abstergo costs too much. Financially and otherwise. Not going in the Animus. I wonder if the Fry Twins would still recognize London. A rooftop's still a rooftop. How do you know about the Fry Twins? But okay, we're in London. Is that the London Eye? I think it might be kind of hard to tell through all the rain, but... Yeah, okay, so we're in London. Hi, Ra. How's it going out there? Well, no threats in view. I'm glad we could work together again. Wait. I believe our working methods are compatible. Why does the name Kiyoshi Takakura sound familiar now? Is that a name from Initiates that I'm- that I haven't- I, I miss the old Initiates. There was a lot of lore there, and it was really exciting, to the point where I visited it every day. But... Now it's not a thing anymore, so that sucks. What do you think we should do next? Of course, I'll return to the Animus, then follow the trail Irodotos left to find the staff. But there's so many possibilities, so many choices. There's no way to know which ones are right. You used to run part of the Japanese Brotherhood. Ah! What would you do? Take things one step at a time, yeah. observe their act, or kill everyone and search their pockets for answers. You decide. So he was. Yeah, there was one part of Assassin's Creed Initiates that, um, he, uh, it was in, damn it, what city in Japan did, did Gavin and all his assassins go to? Um, and then they were attacked by the Japanese Brotherhood and everything, that whole thing happened. Yeah, okay, so that basically confirmed, yeah, he's, he's, he's from Initiates, I think. Are you still upset about our last run-in with Abstergo? I'm sorry, I didn't realize those hills in Quebec were so steep. But hey, you and your Yakuza reflexes saved us! Yakuza. Sorry. Ex-Yakuza. We're all alive and our injuries have healed. That's what matters. I'm glad that you're such a forgiving soul, sir. Thanks for watching our backs, Kiyoshi. I'll leave you to your work. I'll report in if Abstergo drops by. Thank you. Okay, cool. Looks third echelon. 
Or was it four? Are you fucking? What? <laughs> so. Looks third echelon. Or was it four? Is this. Is this confirming that all of Ubisoft's, or at least most of Ubisoft's IPs exist in the same universe? Splinter Cell, Ghost Recon, Watch Dogs, Assassin's Creed. Cause that's a bit insane. And it also doesn't make a whole lot of sense because, you know, like, there's magazines and stuff with, like, the Splinter Cell games on the cover and stuff. I don't know if those are just Easter eggs, and, I mean, there's also magazines with Assassin's Creed on the cover in Watch Dogs, but that makes enough sense because Abstergo Entertainment is, you know advertising these experiences as games even though they totally really happened so that makes enough sense but that not so much why is it carl with a heart on that box oh underscore men rules omen rules okay whatever too bad we had to leave before we could drink some more caribou i don't know what that is and i'm not sure i want to know either too bad we had to ah, leave before we could drink some more caribou stop it I thought there was another interactive thing back there, but there wasn't. Okay, so, cool. We have a pair of Sam Fisher's goggles. That's awesome. Hey, Victoria. Let's see what we got here. Fascinating. Layla, can you believe we're meeting Herodotos himself? I can. Alana Ryan. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything I can help you with? I don't know your name, Alana. What do you know about him? So I've met Herodotos, but I don't know much about him. He's brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. <laughs> Yay! He's a good hero to have. <laughs> I like Alana. She's cool. Get off my controller pin. So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotos. He basically invented the concept of recording history. I knew it. And other figures are matching up too. Cleon, Pericles. The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history's cool too. History I've loved very history cool. since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor, so I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. Good for you. you make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? Excuse me? Irish? Irish lineage. And then she drops the make your own luck line, which is Shay's completely overused <laughs> catchphrase in Rogue. That's cool. Is she? Could she be one of his? Because I know Shay's lineage continues. Is it his son or his grandson or something? His great grandson, I'm not sure, named Kujul, right? Kujul Cormac? I think was his name. I don't really know anything about that story because it's from like a book or something and I haven't read it. But yeah. Is Alana his What? That's so cool! Oh, this is I love I love present day in Assassin's Creed. It's so awesome. I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. I mean, would it kill you to put, you know, like face cam up or something? Come on. I should check. Oh, sorry. Yep, I'm checking your email right now. All right. Cool. That was a heck of a lot of reading. Where did you get that? Eagles are fine and all, but a pet monkey would be even cooler. No, nah, eagle's pretty cool. Eagle's pretty fucking cool. Where did they get that? Phoebe had it. Cassandra gave it to Phoebe. How did we get that? What? 
Ah. What? It's a it's a rabbit. It's a it's a rabbit. What? Hey, what's the matter you up there? <laughs> That's the new one for this game, I guess. This is the next best thing. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. No animus pulse for Layla. I think I found everything. Can I talk to you again, v ah. Vicky Vic? Sorry, Vicky Vic. Okay. What? I think I've got everything. Let's go back in. Are you sure you want to go back into the Animus right now? I get the impression you'll be there a long time. I got some grinding to do. Yep. Yes. I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right. I'll be watching your back. Thank you. Oh, the music is so pretty. So what does it do now? I upgraded it. Spear is stronger now. The cult won't stand a chance. Leonidas' spear. Upgrade the spear here at the Forge of Hephaestus during using artifact fragments. Okay. Upgrading it increases your adrenaline and unlocks more powerful abilities. So that's why a lot of those skills were unable for me to upgrade them. Collect artifact fragments from defeated members of the Cult of Cosmos. Review the quest menu to track progress or more for more spirit. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I don't have any of these. 6% health gained per adrenaline spent. That's cool. Maximum adrenaline segments 5. Maximum ability rank 2. Okay. 2 of 6. Wow. Okay, but well, whatever. Next time I get an ability, I'm freaking using that. All right. Now I'm. Yep, I'm just leaving. I gotta go talk to Irototos now. How'd I go? Oh, this place is awesome. It makes me think of you know like the Ethereum Forge in Skyrim, except well, cooler. Well, Irototos will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before we were. Far, far before. A long time ago. A galaxy not so far away. Did Leonidas know this place existed? Maybe. It would explain why he became king and was so legendary. He had the power of the Isu on his side. But again, that spear was not his to begin with. That thing's. Oh god, that was rude. Oh! Time to talk. Fuck! Alexios, Demos, whatever I'm supposed to call you, brother, I don't, what's brother in Greek? I don't know that, sorry. <laughs> and on that note, what's sister in Greek? Those would be interesting words to know for this game. Bro. You're not hard to track. Thank you. Did you come alone? Are you alright? <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't get too close. Don't touch me. <laughs> Come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened to you? Lady, do you I don't know? I tell you anything. I don't know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things it, to argue you're about. You're an itty bitty baby. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention, if that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. We're family. And we made it out of Sparta alive. <laughs> yes, it did show the truth. His voice is a little it different than I was expecting. I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain. I the Oracle did that. Thank you very much. I tried to save you. You're wrong. If that's what you think, Alexios, you must have hit your head on the way down. He hit everything. I've heard this story, and not from a liar like you. And never call me Alexios. I will call you right. that till the day you die. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Yeah, okay. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. You, uh, you, uh, hmm, you've been listening to the wrong people, buddy. That's not who you are. Sounds like a fantasy to me. Did the cult- Search your feelings! Let go of I your hate! Watch your fucking mouth. 
Whoa! I'll shut it for you. Watch your fucking you mouth! didn't when you had the chance before, and I bet you won't now. This is stupid. We need to find our mother. I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. I'm not. I'm... Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. Mirini. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. Right? So how about if you help don't me? Know where she is? That means she abandoned you too. How sad. Bruh. He doesn't seem to feel anything for this family. He doesn't remember them! He's got one whopping memory, and it ain't a good one. <laughs> should I try and tug at the heartstrings a little more, or should I be blunt? Either way, I don't think he's gonna listen. <laughs> Dude... You deserve a guilt trip. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. I know. I am way... Oh. Oh. Shiitake. Oh, no. Well, now I really don't know what to do. Elpinor was easy enough. I wouldn't trust that shit stain. Th <sighs> I don't know. I, I, okay. Honestly, both of these are lies, okay? I'm gonna lie to him no matter what. Because I definitely found him, and I definitely did not kill him, either. If I say I never found him, they'll keep looking. I'm gonna say I killed him. If they're after all of us, there's one less person to find. I killed Nikolaus. Yet here you are, acting so righteous, when really, you're just like me. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. He's Come not with going me. to. What? We could find her. Together. He's too far gone. She could help Cassandra. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. Fuck you. You're weaker than me, okay? I didn't succumb to my situation like you did. I'm playing nice. Weak? I've had to kill for much longer than you've had to. Oh, I'm so scared. I have an army behind me. One false move, and you're obliterated. That's the plan. I've got a plan of my own. I want to know this. The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. Uh, what does that have to do with our parents, though? I guess if we have the blood, they have the blood. But what would killing them accomplish? You didn't really answer my question. Or at least I didn't get the answer I wanted. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Fuck that! Those who don't stand with us, stand against us. And they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go... How did you hear that? Pericles and his elitist scum. They're next. Okay, buddy. You can call it whatever you want. You're kidnappers. You're abductors. You're murderers. I'm Mistios, which I suppose could also mean that thing, but... Oh, God. There are shades of gray in every good story. You're going down, bruh. I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. Am I backing and down now? you no. still think you stand a chance? I do. Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. Oh, pick up the controller right fucking now. Okay. 
I don't want to hurt you. We still found each other, brother. Ow! I told you not to touch me. But you're so sexy. Ugh. Malaka. Herodotus won't believe this. Where is he going? To tell him what happened. How did he get here? And where is he going? I'm sure he's got his own boat somewhere else, or he's gonna swim. Sharks would be suicidal to pick a fight with that guy. <laughs> That's not the voice I was expecting from him. But, uh, yeah. That thing I said... There's no way Alexios could have survived that fall. <laughs> Somehow he defied the odds and he did. Which is crazy. Maybe that's how we learned to do the leap of faith. We both landed in a haystack conveniently. Hello, Herodotos. Sorry I'm late. <laughs> well, was the legend true? Yep. Was it magnificent? Yep. What happened to you? And your spear? Awesome, oh, thanks. Herodotos. My spear is stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. Man, if there I were playing as Alexios, kind of that would be so wrong sounding. It showed me a vision of me and my mother. So, the ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, oh boy, don't you, you have know no it. idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. It's not the only That's one. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. They're going after us. My family, Pericles. I think we better Why get to Athens then. You? Unless it was a trap. It's a trap! It doesn't matter. Oh, we have God. to get to Athens to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. That then would be ideal. We go to the Penix. If Pericles is anywhere, the what? he's there. The what? The, 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 the penis with an X? What? Wow! Holy goddamn! <laughs> 